Scary story number 13. So when I was a kid, we lived in Arkansas, and we just moved into the house. It was a suburban neighborhood, and there were no street lights at the time. There was just empty fields and a tree line. <laughs> So within the first couple of days of living in the house, when I woke up one night, it was pitch black outside. I didn't know what time it was, but I saw a creature standing in the window and it stood all the way to the top of the window. And these were really tall windows. <laughs> It had glowing yellow eyes, long pointy fingers, and it was bony with a hunched back. I just saw it standing there, staring at me. <laughs> and I was so scared, I couldn't even scream. <laughs> I was standing there for a while, trying to figure out what it was, but I eventually... <laughs> I was, I was standing there for a while trying to figure out what it was, but eventually I ran to my parents' room. I tried waking up my mom, but she wouldn't wake up, and then I saw it standing in their bedroom window like it knew where I was in the house. I got so scared that I ran into my mom's walk-in closet because I knew there were no windows. I f <laughs> Eventually, I fell asleep. My mom found me in the walk-in closet the next day and asked why I was asleep in her closet. I told her what had happened that night. But she never believed me. She told me it was all just a dream. But I knew it wasn't.